That's fun. Can you jump? With you. Let me say thank you, Mama. Good morning, guys, and welcome to today's vlog. It is Parents' Day Out. Parents' Day Out. Woo! We're going Woo. on a date. Yeah, Woo. we have a We got babysitter. the whole day to ourselves, basically. Yeah, we've got a babysitter at the house right now. We actually just had to go back home because we forgot our memory card. Pretty sure we've put one in the car as like a backup a few times and then it doesn't get put back in to the car. So we actually just finished up at my doctor's appointment. We had to wait for just a long, like an hour and a half, Over, I think. Yeah, it was like an hour and a half. 33 weeks and my I'm supposed to go every two weeks now. I'm actually going in three weeks because that's just like when the doctor had an appointment available or whatever. But it's good because every for every appointment this whole pregnancy, I've been like on the paper where it like shows the schedule. I'm like a week in between. Like I've kind of been going on a weird schedule, which it doesn't really matter. But like you're supposed to go at like 32 weeks and 34 and whatever. And I went at like 31 and 33. So it's just like bugged me. So I'm happy that now I'll be like on track so that my week matches the paper. So I think I have, oh, this is flashing. What, the battery? Me. Okay, we're gonna finish vlogging on the my phone <laughs> after this I knew dies we have we're going it. to bye bye baby so i'll get a little bit of footage in there just on my phone and then we can like fix the camera when we get back home but anyways yeah so i go at 34 no 36 weeks and then i think you start going every week after that like 37 38 39 whatever that'll be fun i can't believe we're at the end i feel like i'm like not really pregnant like i feel like i'm pregnant i feel very pregnant but I just like, Your I don't mindset, know. You don't feel like <laughs> I don't know. I just like, it's so weird to like be pregnant when I already have a baby. I'm like, wait, I already have one of these. Right. But we just need to get a couple of things at Bye Bye Baby. I have a list, so we'll show you guys what we get, but that's what we're doing on our little date. And did you and see we're going to the mall? We've got some stuff to return. I don't know if we'll film in there. Oh. Yeah, we have to return. But, we went yeah. to Zara last week. Parker needs to return a pair of pants. We're gonna get cheese on a stick again because we need some lunch and we're just gonna go to the food court. Yep. And then one of my friends texted me and she's like, I'm really paranoid that you already got the new baby, like the gift that I got for her. Like don't buy anything else for her. And I was like, I haven't really bought much, like what is it? And then she sent me a picture and it was the outfit that I had just bought, but she like customized it and put the baby's name on it. So I'm also gonna return that outfit that I got, the cute little like pink sex. It'll be way cuter with her name on it. So yeah, we're gonna do that. Probably won't film it because it's just like fast. But anyways, yeah, we will catch up with you guys at Bye Bye Baby. I'm so excited to go in here. All right, we made it in. Here, guys. Already found something that we don't really need. Oh, you know what? Which is this <clears throat> book. We have the mama one and the dada one and Cole loves them. So I'm getting her the baby one. The All right. Hopper. First thing we oh, actually need. Open. Haka, this is the best. You put this on your boob that you're not breastfeeding on and it gets all the extra milk. This is like the best way to build your freezer supply in the beginning. Yeah. I didn't have to actually pump in the beginning like at all. It's it crazy so how, nice. uh, how much milk actually sucks into that. Yeah, especially like this, at the beginning. I wonder if there's one open to show how big it is, but no. it, like, it gets a solid like five, six ounces. Yeah. Just from dripping. Yeah, it has a lot, which is, <clears throat> sounds gross, but <laughs> it's a, it's a very good invention. Yeah. Next, we'll need a bottle brush. I think we just need one of them though, right? Yeah, and bottles. I'm only These gonna get two. <clears throat> and we like the Como Tomo. Cove honestly took anything, but I was like stocked up last time on a couple different ones, which is good, but I don't know. We just, I feel like we had way too many. But we'll have these two, and then where did those yellow ones that we have? Where did that come from? Uh, they went to a bottle or to oh, a the pump. Oh, the hand pump. I need to get the and hand. All right, I found it. This thing was the best. Before I had a baby, I was like, why would anyone ever have like a manual hand pump? Like, that's so dumb. You can get an electric one that doesn't work. This is the best. It's so good for on the go. I'm pretty sure that I used it more like, than you. Like, on, on you. I was the one always doing it. I don't remember that. Yeah, I was. <laughs> I don't think so. This is the best though if you're like in the car or on the go. It's so easy to clean because it's like the smallest like thing. And I should think it get, comes with two bottles too. You get Cove a potty training Maybe toilet? We actually should, yeah. Like, look at this toilet seat. It's a pop Oh, she would love that. Okay, yeah, in the potty section. Haven't been here before. I've been trying to decide if- In like a couple weeks, or months, or years. Yeah, I mean, I might as well get it because she will love that. Yeah. <laughs> I've been trying to decide if we should get like a little potty. We haven't really looked into potty training at all yet because we're just gonna wait a little. Like she's not ready for sure. We ask her all the time, well, like, do you wanna cool. go on the potty? And she says no. But I've been trying to decide if I want something that goes on a regular toilet or a little toilet like, like a, which i would rather have her go on the normal one but i know sometimes it's like overwhelming so right. i don't know also what. guys 
we I'd actually, say that's a no. We have this. A no? You want, you thought it was a good purchase? Yes. Wait, I oh. still use it every, like, every you time do? I give her a bath. I use the other one. Oh, okay, yeah, yeah. I mean, a knee pad in general. Yeah, a knee pad, I feel like is, could be yes or no. Because you can just use a towel. Oh, what? This is, I was seriously thinking the other day that I wanted an elbow one. I was just uh, pointing this out to Aspen, and I was going to say, how could there possibly be any room for any new, like, child or, like, baby inventions i feel like everything is thought of like this this is what i thought i saw and i'm like oh that's how you keep the water out of your baby's face when you're rinsing their head everything they thought of everything for babies getting this for sure the nose frida looks gross best invention ever though i think that might be everything besides diapers let's get diapers and okay. we could get wipes we're gonna get these pampers wipes we get two, or I guess they only have one box yeah. from the newborn size. Yes, yes. Let's well, just we don't start have with room that. for anything else. Okay, we'll start with that. All right. I'll show you guys everything we got when we got when we home. We are finished with our errands. We stopped by the house to pick up the babies. And now we are at a splash pad. We haven't been to one of these in a while. We used to come like every day almost. Yeah, we would. This is one that I actually brought Cove to a while ago. This is a, this is probably the best splash pad in Utah. Yeah, this is I've a good one. I've seen a lot of people post about it, but this is a really it's cool like, splash pad. It's not that far away from our house, and it's like kind of a drive. So I don't know when they turn off, but we were like, wait, we should do that. It's almost starting to get cold. It's kind of yeah. hot right now. Yeah, in the now, morning but and night, it's like a It's like kind of chilly. chilly, yeah. Coco, are you having fun? She usually does not like splash pads, but this part is like mellow enough. I actually haven't been here with her. This is only her second time being here. Parker brought her last time. I don't remember where I was. I think I was out of town, but Coco, how fun is this? We gotta live up the last few days of only one baby and warm weather. That's fun. Can you jump? Woohoo! Yeah, girl. brave and try the other part. Come on, Coco. Come try this part. You need your sunglasses? It's kind of bright, huh? We've moved on to the zip line. Do you want to try? Oh, you don't want to try? Woohoo! Does that look fun? Want to try? Do you want to try it? Go, Coco! Woohoo! Oh my goodness, that's cool. Good job, baby. You're so brave. Oh. <laughs> All right, so we are back from the park. That was a blast. It is now dinner time, so I'm gonna get started making some dinner. Today's video is also sponsored by HelloFresh. So, I'm gonna be making a HelloFresh meal. Let's see. Today, I'm making the uh, black bean and poblano burritos. These actually look really good. We haven't had these before. I'm excited. This one's actually pretty quick. It's only 15 minute prep time and 40 minute cook time. HelloFresh cuts out stressful meal planning and meal prepping so you can have your dinner on your table in right around 30 minutes. HelloFresh also has more five star recipes than any other meal kit delivery service so you always know you're getting something delicious. And also HelloFresh's pre-portioned ingredients makes for less food waste and less food prep. So I'm going to go ahead and get started making this food and we're going to do a little uh, cooking montage. All right, that shot was kind of a fail because I didn't realize that I didn't have the tomato sitting on the cutting board with the first part. So the first part had no tomato and now the tomato's there. But all the food is chopped. I gotta move on to the next step, which is in a small bowl, combine minced onion. Oh yeah, I gotta mince a little bit of onion, add the tomato, half the cilantro, squeeze a lime, season with salt and pepper. If you keep this up, then I'll let you in, cause you have a way with me like no one else. Yeah, you almost make me fall in love. Yeah, you. Final step, it says to place these on a nice flat surface and then basically put all the filling in. So first, I'm gonna add rice. It says about a third a cup. 
Oh, tray. I'm gonna do these simultaneously, side by side. I'm gonna put half a cup of filling. Then I need to do the pico de gallo, some guacamole, a little bit of this sauce, and then a little bit of cheese. And do a squeeze of lime. So then it says to pull this and these. This is gonna be a messy burrito. I'm gonna transfer these over to plate now and then it says to have them diagonally I have to uh, go take this to Aspen and do an official taste test to make sure that it's worthy <gasps> she's coming up I made you dinner you want some they've been playing down in the basement I said that I said that to finish it off, we had to do a taste test and make sure that you approve of this burrito. Anything that's like Mexican food from HelloFresh is always my favorite. Let's see, what do you think? Mm -mm -mm. Pretty good, huh? Mm -hmm. I put a lot of love into that. Mm. Made it special for you. That's yummy. Anyways, as always, HelloFresh gave us a code for you guys. If you go to HelloFresh.com and use the code Aspen and Parker 14, you can get 14 free meals plus free shipping. That link is also in the description. Make sure you guys check it out. You want some? Honestly, we love their food. Super convenient. Super easy to make. What? You want some burrito? You want some? So it is the next day now. I wanted to show you guys really quick, just like a quick overview of what we got from Bye Bye Baby. And then I'll probably go upstairs and put this stuff away. Parker is in the shower right now, getting ready to go. We're gonna take Cove to the trampoline park. Then we also were gonna pack today because we're going on a little baby moon this week. It was kind of like last minute. I was trying to figure out when we could go. And this was like the only free weekend that we had. And I'm getting pretty close to like where I probably shouldn't travel anymore. I don't know what the official like recommendation is, but there's no risk with like flying or anything it's just like if you happen to go into labor early so we're just going somewhere over the weekend which i'm excited about and that'll be like our last trip and we're actually not taking cove with us so it's like a little mini baby moon last time we went to the bahamas which was so fun and i wanted to do that this time but it just like didn't work out so we are packing today for the trip and cove is going to be staying at my mom's so we need to get like all of her stuff packed but i wanted to show you guys really quick um, everything that we got. I feel like we didn't get like a ton of stuff, but somehow we spent like $200. So we did get a pack of wipes and also a pack of newborn diapers. Obviously we need way more of those, but I have a little like baby shower brunch thing um, next week. And I just wanted to like see what I get from that before I like officially stock up on diapers. Got that. I got the hand pump, like I showed you guys, best thing ever. And also the Hakka, which is also the best thing ever. Those are definitely must-haves. I got a thing of bottles, which is good to have. I think that this hand pump comes with either one or two bottles. So if I have four, I should be like, that should be literally like plenty. I'm not even gonna open this one until I like actually need it. Um, we got the nose Frida, which is the best. We also got that bottle cleaning brush, nipple balm, very glamorous. I also got this toothbrush, which I'm way excited about. Cope has like 50 toothbrushes, but this one, I was thinking I needed something like this. It's like triple sided. It is so hard to brush her teeth. It's literally like my least favorite thing of the day. She just fights it every single time, like no matter what we do. So I'm always worried that I'm like not brushing her teeth thoroughly enough. So this is nice because it like cleans all sides of the teeth at once. I also got this, which I'll go give Cove right now, the baby book that we showed. Got another car mirror. We have to have this in the car because I get really stressed out if we can't like see the baby. Anytime that we ever like don't have coves in there, I'm like stressed out that we can't see her. If we like moved it between cars or something. And I got this freaking Paw Patrol toilet seat. <laughs> I don't know when we'll use that, but good to have. And then we actually got Cove some bathtub markers. She has some crayons, but I'm gonna go outside. I feel like these might be a little bit easier to clean and I don't know, we'll see. So yeah, that is everything that we got. So I need to go put all this stuff away and then we'll head to the trap park. But I do wanna give this to Cole right now. She's watching a show, so I don't know if she's gonna care, but 
Let's go give it to her and see. Coco, I got you a present. Look. <gasps> Look what mom got. You know how we have a mama book and a dada book? This is a baby book. Do you like it? Do you want me to read it to you? Yes. Okay, I would love to read it to you. Can you say thank you, mama? Thank you, mama. Oh, you're so sweet. This is baby. Let's play and laugh and sing. What are the parts of baby? Well, I'll tell you everything. Every breath we take, you're falling. I ain't got no time for romance. But baby, I don't want to lead you on. Now I'm looking for something steady. Not ready for that. I'm the best thing that has ever happened to you. Good job. Yeah. Make a move The way my hands feel on your body They were dancing in the dark With every move I make you're falling The way my lips feel on your body The way we're moving in the dark With every breath we take you're falling So since our trip is short, this is what we are attempting to pack in. It's only like two full days. So we could have done just like one carry-on suitcase, but this is just like easy because you have it on your back. I have our toiletry stuff, my makeup, self-tanner, of course. Then I have my clothes in here and Parker's clothes underneath here. And then I have my airplane outfit picked out. So I'll wear that there and back just because the flight is like really short. Or I actually do have like an extra outfit that I can wear. I could wear this on the way back. We'll see. I think it's going to be warm, but we looked it up and it could be like a little bit potentially cold some nights so hopefully i'll be warm but if i'm freezing i have this like sweater and i think i just need to put shoes in here that's actually going to take up a lot of space yeah i have some flats so i'll throw those in here and then i don't know i'll figure out the shoes but next i need to pack cope stuff okay so i threw this purse in here because this is what i probably will use instead of a backpack i'm probably going to take a backpack too so our shoes can fit in my backpack if they need to and then i can have this purse for when we actually like go out since i won't need like a diaper bag and then for cove this is a backpack we have used for her when we travel since she has been a newborn we've always like pretty much been able to fit everything in here besides obviously like her crib doesn't fit in here but or usually her diapers don't but like all her other stuff does i picked her out an outfit for tomorrow and then like i said it's two full days so i have a set another set that's why i love sets and dresses because they're just like so easy i have an outfit for the day that we will pick her up and then i'm bringing one pair of pjs for her she doesn't even wear pjs like half the time since it's summer so it's three nights but one pair of pjs should be fine because again i don't know if she'll even wear them and i didn't even bring an extra outfit because they're gonna be at my mom so if my mom had to like wash something she could do that and like it would be fine but usually Cove only goes through like one outfit a day and half the time she takes her clothes off anyways because we take her clothes off when she eats lunch just to like have less laundry so i'm also packing a sweater for her just in case it gets cold. So we have her Paw Patrol sweater, of course. And then she's been liking to sleep with her little stuffed animals. I think she has like four or five of these. So I took two of them to stick in here. And hopefully Evie doesn't get a hold of them, my mom's dog, because she destroys like everything that she touches. Luma never did that. Luma will just sit and like lick the animals, but Evie literally like eats them. So then I also have Cove's sleep sack. I've been giving her the option of sleeping with a blanket or a sleep sack and she pretty much picks this like every single time and i also gave her a pillow and she doesn't really use it so i'm not going to bring that i also have lotion and i have a body wash for her that i'm going to stick in here i have a full pack of wipes and then a new pack of diapers this is probably too many but and then the only other things we need to get tomorrow actually i need to grab her toothbrush right now really quick i'll do that and then when she wakes up tomorrow i'll get her camera her baby monitor and her sound machine and she'll have shoes on in the car. That's pretty much all that she needs besides like her crib. So Parker will grab that to put it in there. Yeah, that's it. So not too bad. I think that's mostly it. I guess I could end the vlog here. Thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to check out HelloFresh, which will be linked down below. You guys can use our code if you wanna get 14 free meals. Aspen and Parker at 14. Um, I'm super excited for our trip. We are vlogging, so I think we're literally just gonna be like relaxing the whole time. Like we're going somewhere super chill. So I'm really excited to just have like one little last weekend getaway before we have two babies. Yeah, I think that's gonna be it for today, but I hope you guys enjoyed watching and we'll see you guys in the next vlog. Bye guys. The way I do, where I do will not kill down